Hello. Gonna see if anybody hops on. I'm gonna give it about a minute or two. If you're watching the replay, drop in the comments, hashtag replay or whatever. Ask any questions that you may have. Um, throw them out there. I'll get them later. Um, it's such a nice day outside. Like, it is so nice. I'm so excited. Um, if anybody knows me, I'm a warm weather girl. I love warm weather. I do not like the cold. I do not thrive well in the cold. I am like a... I'm like a flower, I would say, probably. I don't thrive very well in the cold. If I could, I would probably be like a bear and hibernate all winter. But, you know, we're human and we can't. Yeah. Warm weather is my friend. And I'm very excited that it's warm today. I'm going to go ride. Um, this type of weather makes me excited to go riding. So, yeah. I don't know. But, I don't know. I actually have, so it's, I don't have the warmer on hand. Um, I decided not to snag the warmer right now. Um, but yeah, I have the scent and I'm going to smell it. It's the first time that I'm smelling this scent, guys. Like I got this yesterday. I thought I got it the day before, but turns out that was not it. It was a different order of mine. <laughs> But I'm excited. Okay, one more moment here. Okay. All right. I'm just gonna dig in. I mean, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get started. Um. So, currently this month, every single month. So if nobody here knows, um, if you do, that's awesome. Here's a little bit of a refresher. Um. Every single month. Scentsy comes out with a warmer and a scent of the month. Now, this warmer is specific to the month. Doesn't necessarily have to look like the month in a sense, like, but it's specific to the month. It is only for that month. Um, so basically, it's formulated. It's built for that month. It doesn't come out until that month. Um, then there's a scent that's formulated with it and everything. So that scent will be there that month and etc. The one thing that I will tell y'all, this is a, this is like a special. It's going to be in our specials tab on my website, but this is a monthly special. I know some of y'all have asked me in the past, like any specials going on, really our specials are in that specials tab and the specials that we have are going to be our clearance section our bundle and save section where you can save a dollar or more um and then it's going to be our current and past scent and warmers of the month past scent and warmers of the month are going to be in their own little section um, you'll find it there in the specials tab in the menu, but they'll be there and they will, um, be full price. Okay. The current scent and warmer of the month is going to be 10% off the entire month while supplies last. They're going to come in different variations, the scent is, but the warmer is going to be there as well. So definitely go check that out. Right now we have Desert Bloom, which is an adorable, like, so if you've seen our aloe vera warmer, it's basically a shorter version of that, but it's super cute. It's got a crackle finish. Each individual piece of that warmer was put on by hand individually. How awesome is that? You will find that all of our warmers are going to be hand rolled, hand blown, hand mosaic, stuff like that, hand painted. That is part of why our warmers are priced higher than warmers you'll find anywhere else. 
also because of our safety rating. You do not have to, but you can leave your warmers on 24-7, 365. Mine, as soon as they, I, can, I swap mine out every couple months or so, depending. I'm probably going to be swapping one of mine out here soon. Actually, two of mine out here soon because Easter is over and I'm going to be starting to put some new stuff. Um, but anyway, so back on track, your warmers can be left on 24 seven. If you want them to be, they are firefighter approved. They are safe. The safest warmer that you will ever have in your home. They are not burners. So I do want to get that out there. I'm going to, I'm going to probably repeat that more every time I go live or every time I talk about the warmers because that's one reason why I decided since he's going to be the go-to and my husband jumped on board with that after he smelled all the scents because he loves fragrance. Um, but ours are left on 24 seven. Thanks. No, he's digging at the window. It's open. It's nice out. Um, but 24 seven, literally. But like I said, you don't have to leave them on that long. I just personally do because I tend to forget to, I was the person who forgot to blow out the candles before going to bed or leaving the apartment. That's bad. So I needed something that was going to be okay. If I forget to turn it off, it's not a big deal. Uh, so mine are left on 24 seven, whether I'm home or not, just saying, but anywho, this upcoming month. So right now, like I was saying, we have the Desert Bloom Warmer. It's at 10% off right now. And it's got Ruby Nectarine as its scent that corresponds with it. Ruby Nectarine is actually pretty good. Um, it's not like an extremely strong scent. So it's actually like really cool. Um, I wasn't sure about it because sometimes here's the thing about our scents. When you read the description, they'll surprise you sometimes. Because when you read the description and you get this bar and you smell it, and you're like, oh my gosh, this is like 10 times better than what I thought it was going to be. Or you may smell it in the bar form and you may be like, mm, I don't know about this. But as soon as you warm it, you're like, dude, this is great. This is amazing. I do that a lot. I tend to be like, okay, I don't really know if I like it in wax form. I'm not sure if I'm going to like it from the description, but I'll try it and see. And then I'll give you guys my honest opinion. And then I'll warm it and see how it goes with warming and give you guys that honest opinion. So, and it also, keep in mind, it goes with the size of your room as well. So I will, I'm starting to like kind of figure out a way to be able to explain to you guys, okay, I have this size of room and it's going like it's filling it well or whatever. So I will give you an honest review of how this warms as well once I'm ready to go with that. But this is next month. So right now we are currently in April. So we have Desert Bloom and Ruby Nectarine at 10% off right now. So go check that out in the current scent and warmer of the month section of the specials. But this is coming next month, okay? So next month, we are going to be getting the, oh, come on, open it. My nails have color streak on them, so I'm basically like, basically painted. So they're, they're not as sharp when they've got polish on them. Do, 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 do. All right, next month, month of May. We are going to be getting the bubbled iridescent warmer. You can't, it's going to be a little bit clear and it's going to have an iridescent finish on it. And I'm going to show you a picture here soon. Keep in mind, we have colored light bulbs. So if you're not a fan of having the clear bulb in there, grab a colored light bulb, throw that in there. We've got blue, purple, orange, red, and green. Um, throw one of those in there. Uh, from what I have seen, they're very pretty, but 
All right, and then the scent of the month is going to be pink lemon water. I have not smelled it yet, so we're going to see what I think. Give you my honest opinion. So here is a picture here. Here, I'll do that. Oh, I'm trying not to get the... Okay. Can you see that? So there is the bubbled iridescent warmer and then the bar. So let me fold this over. Here it is again. You can kind of tell that there's that iridescent finish. But it's going to be, okay, so the bubbled iridescent warmer. Pearly iridescence transforms a contoured organic shape into a major statement that looks ready to pop. It is glass. It is six and a half inches tall. And it's a 25 watt warmer. So it's going to take a 25 watt bulb. We have colored bulbs for that. So. Here are a couple other pictures. Sorry guys, I'm like really trying not to get the light with the logo back there so you guys can see a little bit better. So, bubbled iridescent warmer lit in daylight. Bubbled iridescent warmer lit in low light. And this is it lit. Um unlit in daylight. Daylight, low light, unlit. Cool. All right. So really quick. I was going to grab the thing real quick, but okay. So here are the notes of the upcoming pink lemon water that I'm going to smell in a second. So first description, rose water infused with refreshing lemon and a spoonful of sugar. It's going to go in our, excuse me, it's going to go in our citrus category. It's going to come in a scentsy bar, room spray, and a scent circle, all at 10% off. Top notes, of this warmer the first thing that you smell okay so this is going to be the first thing that you smell when you open this up is the top notes fresh squeezed lemon you may not get that our noses are different so you may get something else first mid notes are going to be rose water that is going to be what you most likely will smell when you're warming it, when you're first warming it, you're going to smell, okay, fresh squeezed lemon, rose water. Base notes are going to be sugar and sweet musk. That's going to be what you're going to smell after it's been warming for so long. All of these, so when you get a bar, there's going to be the top that you smell, the Mid notes are going to be somewhere mixed in here. And then the base notes, everything basically floods down to here because this is sitting like this for a little while. So what you smell up top isn't always going to be what the bar smells like officially. I'm going to show you what I mean here. So I'm going to open pink lemon water up. I'm going to smell it first time I'm smelling it. Ooh, that's actually... I was terrified I wasn't going to like this, to be quite honest with you, and I, hmm, I really like it so far. I have to warm it, but, so what I'm smelling right here on the top, that is the first hint, okay? So now, yes, I am getting a little bit of lemon, I am getting that rose, and I am getting a little bit of sugar, but the secret to getting a better smell, pop it out. There we go. So up here, because it's sitting the way that it sits, up at the top, you're not always going to get the best smell experience. So you wanna pop this out, you wanna flip it over, you want to shove this into your nose and just be like, oh. And I'm gonna tell you, 
This surprised me. From what everybody has said, and it might be a little bit oily. If it's a little bit oily, that's okay. It's, it's just separating. Break a couple like pieces off. Start with two and put them in your warmer and it'll, it'll come back together. There's, don't worry about it. If we call it sweating, it's fine. It's not gonna, it doesn't mean anything bad. So, but when you smell the bottom of this, because everything settled a little bit, when you smell the bottom of this, you're getting a better scent experience because now you're actually smelling everything like the stronger notes of the scent you're getting that so that this is actually i'm so excited to get this warmed like this is actually really it's awesome smelling um if you have so here's the thing guys if you've purchased from me in the past you know for a fact that you're going to get a sample of this but if you purchase like this month you know you know i sound these but if you would like a sample of this, let me know and I will send you whatever I can send. So I'll send you, so it's getting warmer. Keep that in mind. It is getting a lot warmer out. Um, so I will do my best to send an actual little wax sample, but if I cannot, then I will be sending one of these, a pamphlet, and I'll have the scratch and sniff sticker right here. So that'll send, and you'll have the scratch and sniff sticker right there. Um, but yeah, it's just it's getting warmer outside, which means if I send a little wax sample, it's going to melt on the way. Um, so I have to get like felts and stuff like that. I have to figure out how to really send one of these to you guys, but I'll figure out how to get samples set. Now... These are our past scent and warmers of the month for this year. Blue Agate, regular warmer, mini warmer, and then Sunburst Bamboo, which actually was really good. It reminded me, like, of cucumbers. Um, Gnome for Easter, I have him out right now. And Hey Tiger Lily, that's actually a really good scent, too. I'm not going to lie. All these scents, like, amazed me. Um, and my husband really liked them too. This is our current. So this is currently 10% off right now with the Ruby Nectarine. Go check that out. So these are going to be in the past set and warmer of the month section of our specials. And then this is going to be in our current. This will be next month. Okay. But if you are interested in pre-ordering, if you're interested in checking it out or have any more questions, please let me know. But I'm going to head out. I have to get ready for the barn and go ride on this super nice day. And probably even put my windows down and my sunroof open. So have a great day, guys. And I will talk to you all later. Bye.